So we're going to do a, uh, we're going to talk about a very, very serious topic. Um, extremely serious topic. I am what you might call a vegan consequentialist. And if you're wondering, Shan, people call me Shan on the internet. What is a vegan consequentialist? I would tell you, I do not know because I don't know anything about philosophy. The term I've come up with of vegan consequentialist is uh, completely pseudo intellectual. But ultimately, what I've derived it to mean in my own terminology, appropriating uh, philosophy jargon, is that unless financial ability, financial or physical ability is a concern or physical health is a concern, you have an obligation not to endorse the torture, exploitation and murder of animals. Now, on that note, there's been some really serious drama in the left tube community. A much respected, or until recently respected, gentleman by the name of uh, Samuel Satter, Sater, I think, Sater it is. He had a caller on his show, the... Uh, <clears throat> the Minority Report. And this caller is famous for uh, destroying Destiny in a debate once. And the caller basically uh, told him, uh, if you drink milk, you might as well support the Holocaust. And for some reason, Mr... Mr. Setter was completely unconvinced by that argument. And some people had the gall to be outraged that someone, this moral arbiter, would come in and equate drinking milk to ethnic cleansing. It's horrible. Um, clearly shows uh, Sam Cedar not having any intellectual merit or, or rigor um, such that it is. And it's amazing how Mr. Cedar has such a hard time uh, understanding that the, the parallels between this. Now, there are some who say that uh, it's really bad optics to compare animal agriculture to the Holocaust. And what I would say to those people is, fair point, but hear me out. The caller did perform a thought experiment. And everyone knows that if you have a thought experiment, then... Point proven. You know, I I think he's proven this point, and uh, we should move on to another topic. You see, that, that, point, that point was so decisive that my stream decided to end for a brief second. Point proven. So, I will say that maybe going on to a live stream and saying immediately engaging in animal genocide terminology maybe not the best from an optics perspective but uh, other than that uh, very satisfying performance uh, horrible horrible to see Sam Cedar come out as a cannibal apologist uh, definitely gonna have to cancel my um, my free subscription to him. Or, uh, you know what I'll do? And here's what you should do, actually. If you have a complimentary subscription to the Majority Report, you should send them, like, 
a six or eight dollar donation for however many months you've subscribed and say see we don't need your handouts we don't want to take your support here's here's money so that we can show you that we don't want your support and it's basically you're refunding them your compliment complimentary subscription so it's basically like here's eight dollars because fuck you and that's what i'm going to do um i highly encourage you to do it too um show a picture of it with the hashtag cancel sam cedar and uh yeah hashtag cancel sam cedar uh tweet it with an image of you uh sending him money basically saying i don't want your uh i don't want your support anymore <laughs>